you know, we got coffee. And we got that. Look at that. Wow. Thank you all. Five thousand subscribers. Woo! -hoo. And we can't find Fredo. I don't know where Fredo is. <sighs> anyway. I need to eat. I've been putzing around for an hour trying to get some food. Taffy, Michael, evening. Not too cold. Mm. Mm. Coffee's hot. Mm. Leftovers, meatloaf, mash, and broccoli. And of course, coffee, coffee, coffee. I got started on making coffee, or actually having a cup of coffee, and then I went back to get it, and there was a fly in the soup. There's a dead fly in the coffee. I'm like, should I just scoop it out and eat it, or drink it, or make new coffee. <laughs> I made new coffee. Winters. What do you mean? Physical radio station? Like studios or tower or, or what do you mean? Justin, Dorothy, click your heels three times, Dorothy. Yeah, we don't do that, so don't ask. You'll get banned. Cool. Hey. That's right, they were saying it was going to get damn hot down there. Billy Joel's on TV. I'd rather stay in Oz, yeah. What are you grumbling about, Al? Yeah, I don't live in a trailer, so what does that matter? This is whole food, dude. It ain't from McDonald's. Fan of SML. Hey, Gumby. What movie do I like? I like lots of movies. I don't know. <laughs> hey, Linda. I'm actually eating warm food. I didn't waste too much time. I've never seen the Titanic. I've never seen E.T. <laughs> Baba's here. Cater, you don't know anything.
heavenly unhealthy. <laughs> yeah, we hit 5,000 subscribers today, or yesterday, maybe. Thank you all. Pizza every night. Sicaro? No, I don't. What is Sicaro? Is that a show? I forget. TV show? I forget. Yeah, I'd like to see Titanic. I just never have. Hey, Snow Bunny. Cool style. Yeah, it's been terrible, really. I didn't, I don't know. I was super tired. I couldn't get up and do anything today. I was like out of it. I don't know why. It is 1021. Lynn, hello. Shattered. Yeah, well, I don't have any kids, so that's fine. You're just a twit, so bye. I don't know. You tell me. Oh, <laughs> uh, Back to the Future. Um, I like those movies, yeah. I mean, if you ask me what my favorite movie is, that's I don't know. I have no idea. I have no idea. Bozos have no clue. Uh, oh, hello, uh, Mikala. Um, my favorite movie is uh, On the Beach, the original 1959 with Gregory Peck. There you go, Justin. <laughs> oh my God, I don't know. Favorite actor or actress? I don't know. I'm terrible at that. Yes, Aubrey. See you, Ed. Oh, I don't let them. I try to laugh it off. Really? The Jupiter, too? Where's that at? Where are my hobbies? I don't know. I don't do much anymore. Hallucinogens? Yeah, mushrooms. Maybe a little acid decades ago. Meatloaf, mashed potatoes, and broccoli. Luan, hello. Evening, Paula. Ten thirty ish dinner. Really in, in Nebraska, that's crazy. That would be fun to go visit. That would be crazy fun to go visit. <laughs> Get out of the damn fridge. Chicken wings. Ooh. No, I want chicken wings. <laughs> what is that? 
Is that the submarine? Oh, yep. Yeah. Flashback pictures. We're in the United States in the city. Anybody know what that is? That's a picture I took. It's a flashback picture from June 13th, 2021. You get five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. That's the USS Cod. It's a World War II diesel submarine located here in Cleveland, Ohio. But this picture was taken in Erie, Pennsylvania when it was going to the Don John shipyard for repairs. And I got to be there. Oh, actually, wait a minute. No, 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 no. This is here in Cleveland, I think, when it came back. Sorry. It, went, it got to the Erie shipyard in the nighttime. In the nighttime. But I was there also by chance. That's when they brought it back. There's a funky little place I'd like to go back and check out someday. Cafe Domongo Speakeasy in Detroit. Fried Spam. No, we got no Fried Spam here. Mm. Mm, that sounds kind of interesting. No, that wasn't the purpose. It's happened before. Stupid stuff happens. That place, it's a bar, really. I don't know, it was closed. I just happened to be walking by and took a picture. It was a very weird-looking place. <laughs> very interesting. Oh, yeah, I have a basement. Had two cats fighting down there last night. Go to the video from last night. Nine minutes in, you'll hear cats screaming. <laughs> it's crazy. I don't know how they got in. <laughs> oh, that was right around the time I was chauffeuring this crazy woman here in Cleveland. She was such a prima donna. Meatloaf, mashed potatoes. No, I missed the service. I did have a draft card. But I've worked on government bases and facilities as a contractor. Contractor. No, it's a nasty basement. Lake Worth, Florida. You were here the other night. Hornet. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Dorothy. Yep. No, I just said, Justin, I never served. I just worked as a contractor doing things for the government. I can't tell you. <laughs> they make you s sign papers. And if you don't sign the papers, they break your fingers. But I can't sign the papers. You've broken my fingers. You noticed, Gumby? <laughs> 
a neighbor came to my house one day and said, your cat ran downstairs. <laughs> At the time, I didn't have a cat. <laughs> I was crazy last night. Oh, you missed it, though. Later on, this morning when I got up, that orange cat from last night must have came back into the basement and he got trapped in my trap. <laughs> Poor dude was so flipped out. <laughs> my cat's looking at this cat inside the cage going, what the frick is that? Um, mashed potatoes, meatloaf. <laughs> My poor guy. <laughs> He's like, get me out of here, man. He was pretty flipped out being in that little space. <laughs> Hi. Oh, my. Yep, crunching and munching. Broccoli. Oh, Ryan, well, you know, he's a jerk. I mean... You know, he's a jerk, you know. His inaction killed killed lots of people. He's a douchebag. Trains, oh yeah. Um somewhat homemade. It's from a restaurant, but it's it, they do make it, they don't buy it. No, I don't know where Fredo is. Uh yep. How is everybody tonight? I've gotta go look, yeah, Gumby. Bob Lazar. Yeah, that's a strange dude. And the cats, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Bob Lazar. I just found out, you know, I said this before a few months ago, a friend of mine who was one of the guys that did a lot of the investigative looking into Area 51 in the 80s. Um that Glenn died a couple years ago. I didn't know this. Somehow I missed it. Cancer. I haven't done much. People keep inquiring about stuff I do have posted, but we don't hook up. And I got a phone call from people today that my sister's at the hospital. Uh, she got kind of picked up. And they uh, did some tests on her and might have found some bad things. I don't know. I don't know. Didn't sound good. Coke, I guess. Sprite, Mountain Dew, Lacey. Yeah, I don't know what, I mean, she's, 
been kind of homeless. And, uh, I haven't even seen her for months now. El, Lip, El Pippa. She is the youngest. Yeah, she's here. No, so don't ask or you'll get blocked. Oh, UFOs, who knows? Well, they, they took her in because of mental health issues, but meatloaf, mashed potatoes. Oh, I'm certified. I'm sure I can pass the test. There's there's almost no forklift. For, there's almost no forklift I haven't driven. And I've done some really crazy stuff with forklifts. <laughs> Yeah, drove one off of a dock once, too. <laughs> I jumped. <laughs> oh, raining. D.C. got a lot of rain. Old enough. I wanted to go and get certified just for giggles on my own, just in case someplace ever asked, but, you know. Thank you, Salty. We just passed over 5,000 subscribers yesterday. All the time? Yeah, I sent you those pictures, yeah. Hello from Louisiana. I want to get to New Orleans again. I miss that place. God. The ISS is 29 years old? Wow. Also, today is the 29th anniversary of the Oklahoma City bombing. And I was there, Gavin. I was there two weeks after the bombing. Got to see the building. No, never jumped. Always kind of wanted to. I had photos of the building, but I can't find them. I might have got thrown out. I'm pissed about that. Yeah. I mean, I walked around late at night, and I, I realized when you're down at the far end of the uh, uh, Decatur Street late at night, it might be unsafe to walk walk around. <laughs> Gavin, mm, maybe. Oh, my sister, one of her fits. Luckily, everything didn't get thrown out, but all my travel photos, which were 35 millimeter slides, Kodachrome slides, they're all gone. They're all gone. Oh, you got a kitty cat, Michael? Mine's upstairs sleeping. 
I found him up there sleeping. Hello. The real reason for Voyager 1 and 2? It's a secret plot to bring the Zindi here. <laughs> Just man pushing the boundaries, that's all. <laughs> Two pups. Oh, okay, again. Yeah. Oh, I've been advertising some stuff. I don't know. The only thing that stops it is money right now. Oh, you got a channel? Okay, nice. Oh, that sounds like you might be able to, you know, are you monetized yet? Do you have enough going on? No, I don't cook. I reheat. <laughs> I assemble leftovers. I still got more up there. I should have gotten out today, but I didn't. Instead, I plucked the ear hairs, cut the nose hairs, shaved the beard, trimmed up the hair a little. That took long enough. persons. I don't have much wisdom. <laughs> what do you want to know? And I'm not old. <sighs> you missed it all. That's why. You got here late. You missed out on the wisdom, so... Meatloaf, mashed potatoes in Ohio. Video games, never played any really. Never really gotten into them. Never played any. No, I'm not up for a tour of the house tonight. It's a disaster anyhow. TV with a booty. What? No, we're not enemies yet. <laughs> I can only show three seconds. There's the TV. I'll get a copyright claim by somebody showing that. No, I don't play any games. Nope. I do have a, a retro game box I got. It's only this big. But it has like 200 games. Like Pong and stuff like that. Lost the tooth. Well, that tells me you're too young to be here. <laughs> I'd like to live in D.C. for like a year and find a working Nintendo. They got to be out there, Baba, but how much? <laughs> it was an adult tooth. <laughs> Stop pulling your grandpa's teeth. <laughs> he needs them.
we might have had a, uh, an Atari or something. I don't remember really having any game consoles in the house. Every time you swipe on your live eating. <laughs> yeah, there's a habit. Either that or we're on the same schedule. I know DC is expensive, but I still would like to be there for a year so I could do the things I want to do. There's a lot there I still want to go do. Yep, no kids that I know of. Old enough. All right. I haven't told you how old. Okay, a couple of people have asked. Oh, my. Who's What's that? Oh, RG. RG, you're, you're most kind. Thank you again, RG. Thanks for the support. Um, um, thank you much. Um, so I tell them how old I am like once, okay? When they were walking on the moon the first time, me and three other guys were in jail in Texas, and they wouldn't let us watch the moon landing. It's a math problem. There's a range of answers. That's all you get. Card games, I can play solitaire. I've forgotten how to play. Uh, we used to play rummy. That's about all I know. I don't. I never learned poker really. Mario Brothers and me screaming, turn it down. <laughs> we were bad people in Texas. <laughs> we, uh, we borrowed a couple cars. Borrowed a couple cars. We used to play that a lot when we were kids, Rummy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I still have a lot of bicycles, but I don't ride them as much. Oh, yeah, I was a big bicycle rider. Age 12, I was already riding the suburbs. I'd have to call my parents to come get me, and they're like, you're where? <laughs> How'd you get there? I rode my bike. <laughs> no, I'm not married. No. No prison, just jail. Good lawyers. Good lawyers. There's that famous song from Warren Zevon. Lawyers, guns, and money. Dad, get me out of this. Well, you know, in the U.S. we are free. You know, we have guns. <laughs> Dali. Dali. Do you know who the artist is? Dali. How many miles do you think you would ride? Do you think you walk in a day? I don't know. I don't do that much right now, Gumby. Date my aunt, my, your aunt. <laughs> hey, Sean. Well, that's when we were in jail. Yeah. Yes, Sean. Yeah, famous person I'd like to have dinner with. Yeah, I want to get an e-bike after renting one. I just told how old I was. You'll have to go back. You can hit the red line and go back while we're while we're live. I don't know if you know that. You can move it backward when somebody is actually live. Uh, ever watched the devil? <laughs> Mushroom. Salvatore Dali. Dali. He, he used to say that. I am Dali. I am Dali. He used to have his museum here on the east side of Cleveland, and I never went. It was in a warehouse. You had to make an appointment. I was pissed. Then it went to Florida. No, I got a cat. Well, I think Jesus is a historical character. 
whether or not he's more than that. Aerial or cable? <laughs> Aerial. I think I did at some silly place where you, they give you a pan to pan for gold. <laughs> I can't remember where that is. I think I did that somewhere once. Some tourist thing. I've seen people doing it, though, out in Colorado. But most of the people I saw mining gold in Colorado were doing it out of open veins on the side of uh, mountains. I have a toothpick. Yep, I got a toothpick right there. Nashville, Indiana. Oh, did you see the Russians lost another bomber today? Awesome. <laughs> they can't lose enough. I got a master's degree and I want to move to the U.S. What's a good state to aim for? Goose, where do you live now? And what's your degree in? I mean, you're looking to get work here or do you think you'll get work? Coffee. Coffee, coffee. Rot rods, oh yes. Oh, thank you, Gavin. Oh, who was, who was just asking about moving? Are you like nature and contributing to society? Well, the biggest thing is going to be where you're going to look to work living in Portugal. Yeah. I mean, if you like, uh, you know, the outdoors, you know, Utah is awesome. Colorado, if you like, you got to like winter, you know, if you live there. California offers every season on the planet and every geography and geology. Engineering, what, yeah, what kind? PS4. Ooh. Oh. Okay, Gavin. My brother's a structural engineer. Gary, Indiana. <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> I stop in East Chicago, Indiana to get gas, and that's it. <laughs> Mechanical. Uh, and product engineering. I love Colorado mountains from the pictures. Yeah, you sound like you got good skills. I mean, there's uh, you know, plenty of work for stuff like that, and you know, the space agencies always hiring mechanical engineers. I mean, there there's a lot of need for. I'm sure there's a lot of good jobs over here. Build more indoor gutters. You never know. I uh, just did some. Uh, um, Community college. You're not even from there. <laughs> There's a famous song, Gary, Indiana. Gary. It's not a place to choose to live, though. It's not so bad. <laughs> it had a reputation. You designed the best gutters. <laughs> Hola. You got a beach, yeah. Oh, I was just, I don't remember. I mean, I was taking some computer courses and stuff. Gary is terrible. <laughs> I can do some car. Sure, I can do almost anything mechanical. If you've watched me long enough, you know that. Uh, Syed, hello. Hello from England, hello. Oh, you're up late, my, England, let's see. Uh, 3 a.m.? 
No, 4, 4 a.m. You're up late. Hold on. I gotta file somebody in the way scan here. Okay, they're filed. Oh, they're filed. Another one, you know, somebody got rid of him, yep. Okay, we gotta... Yeah, I've done plenty of auto repair work. Nowadays, I mean, you know, a lot of things have to... You gotta have a lot of test equipment and scanning tools to do a lot of work in the damn cars. Did I work in aviation? No, I've been on a lot of planes. Um... I don't think I've ever worked on a plane. Maybe, maybe I helped on somebody's little Cessna once. <laughs> I don't remember. Oh, you're a developer working, just got out of the office. Oh, my gosh. So you're a coder? I've got a bunch of friends who are coders. One is making insane money now. Sid Hint. Hello. My cousin wanted to tour the abandoned churches and stuff last weekend. Where, where are we talking about? I missed that. Abandoned churches where... Sorry. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, yes, sir. Yeah, so... <clears throat> with the... QT? I don't know what that means, I guess. Hello, Morocco. We've got London here. We've got Morocco. You guys are up late. Your uncle died in World War II. Yeah, my dad served in World War II. I was actually writing an app from the last eight, uh, for the last eight hours. So yeah, I've got a friend here in town. He does, uh, he just got into coding only like five years ago in his 30s. He never did any computer work, went to community college, started taking classes, found out he's really good at it. Hello, Kristen. And uh, um, and he's now, I think he's maybe only the second company he's worked for uh, oh, that's terrible, Gavin. And, uh, uh, well, cell phones and, uh, we've, well, maybe in 50 years we'll have implants. Or it'll just all be on the watch. Who knows? And we'll all wear little screens here that we read everything, like, on our glasses. I don't know. <laughs> and, uh. So he writes apps for tow truck companies uh, for their service work and stuff, I guess. But he, the company he works for, he's, they're throwing him money. Throwing him money. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, and he, when he went to the logistics convention, um, like 10 people approached him and wanted to throw money at him. But he's pretty happy where he is. Oh, I know about, yes, I know a little bit about privacy and encryption, yes. Um, I've been following that, that three-letter agency that uh, Snowden worked for since probably before you were born. <laughs> I started paying attention to them in 1980. <laughs> oh, my dream job. Um, I don't know now, I mean, you know, I think that ship has sailed, I don't know. Right now, I would just like to be able to drive, find something I could do like, um, like delivering now, and just deliver and drive to a city, drop the delivery off, and then spend two days, and then keep doing that. Just enjoy life. Yes, I had a draft card. Yep, I wish I had it, but eh, don't. Who knows where that went? Oh, you're thirty-five. Okay. And uh, he, uh, he's 40. He just turned 40. And him and his girlfriend 
go to Mexico and Central America and stay for like a month or two at a time. And he codes from there, living in gorgeous places and hiking and sunshine and, you know, um, oh, hi, Meg. Um, and, uh, Oh, well, it's 11 o'clock. Yes, it is. The news is on. Investigator Kelly Kennedy has more on the controversial decision and is working to learn more about this law tonight. So this is a law here in the city of Akron that makes it a crime to pull out a replica firearm in an angry or threatening manner. It's also a crime to brandish a fake gun in the presence of a law enforcement officer engaged in duty. Both of these are first-degree misdemeanors. What are you talking about? Uh, no, never got called up. Uh, yeah, crazy money, without a doubt. Yeah, so you know, you know, he has a he didn't. I don't even know if he has a degree. Um, and, uh, you know, he's making, his father was telling me, his father's one of my best friends, his father go, and his father's made good, mo pretty good money in life, not great money, but he goes, yeah, he's making like double what I ever made, double, six figures money, you know, just throwing it at him, you know, just insane. I mean, and uh, I've got another friend on, uh, Insta on I don't talk to him as much on, on uh, Twitter. Uh, Turk, he's in uh, 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 SML. Um, he's in New York City, and uh, um, he's a he's a coder also. He seems to be doing better now. I think he had a rough patch. Mountains and the ocean travel freely. Yes, I've, I've been to 45 states, so I've seen a lot. Hey, Dylan. Um, and, uh, but there's still so much more to see. And now I've got friends everywhere. So it would be so nice to be able to visit these people, hang out. Yeah, Goose, you know, there, there, there sounds like you've got transferable skills, you know, most definitely, you know, thanks for showing up. You need to play heyday the game. Six states. Oh, well, that's still good or good. I know people who've never left the state they, they were born in, you know, where have you been? Drones. Drones are interesting and awesome. <laughs> Charges thousands for finding glitches in WhatsApps and Meta. Um, yeah, that's, yeah, I mean, you, if you know how to do this type of stuff, you know. So I have a good friend who's a, who's got a pretty big YouTube channel now who teaches privacy rights. And he actually developed a messaging app Um uh, see, Ed, have you ever heard of, let's, oh, I don't have it on this phone. Hold on. It's on this phone. You can see, I can show you the icon. Here's the icon. Oh, there's the icon. Have you ever heard of Brax? B-R-A-X. So, Gary, this oh you live over there oh, oh yeah, I I did a lot of Chicago stuff a couple last year and I want to go back now and do more. Um, no, Brax is Brax. It's its own app. He developed the app. I'll show you him on. Uh, uh, oh come on, phone. My fingers touching the wrong things. Oklahoma, Texas, Colorado, California, KS, and Arizona, Arkansas. Uh, OK. 
come on phone populate oh what's with this phone search oh you dummy I'm typing in a phone that doesn't have a SIM card. <laughs> yes, I've been to Detroit three times last year. I'm typing on a phone that doesn't have a SIM card. I'm like, what's what's wrong here? <laughs> oh, my God. I mean, I've been to Indiana a lot. I worked there. Uh, I did a lot of work there in the uh, way back. Donald. Uh, hold on. I was trying to search for Rob here. There he is. Here he, I'll show you here now. Uh, here he is on Twitter. Rob Braxman. He's got a big YouTube channel too. Um, he's in LA. But he developed Brax. It's a, tr it's a triple encrypted end to end messaging app that you can even do audio audio um, on. Uh, I haven't really been on in a while. I kind of fell away. Um, jokes, sure. Yeah, big... Ah! Oh, ah! Oh, look who's here. Oop, baby shark. And uh, baby shark in the house. How you doing, girlfriend? Um... And uh, he's got a pretty big YouTube channel now, too. No, never worked on satellites. We had, what did we have, two, oh, two tornadoes the other day in Ohio here? I guess we're leading the nation in tornadoes this year. <laughs> it's awesome. This guy is old. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. What did you do? Rob's a... Yeah, he also sells stuff. He sells... Uh, um, he sells de-Googled phones. He sells uh, uh, VPN. Uh, v he has, well, he has a VPN, but he also... He was selling a, uh, a Tor router also. face I've missed before I go to sleep. <laughs> Brax needs to develop something for the medical billing. He just got hacked again. Well, actually, that's where he started was in medical software. But he got out of it when it, it turned into a shit show. Uh, you just got hacked again. Oh, my God. Yeah, well... You know, it's written on C++ and made on QT. Oh, you know, or you can tell or whatever. Um, me and him used to communicate a lot, but it's been a while. His app is open sourced. Oh, it is open sourced? I don't know if I knew that. I don't know if I knew that. I don't know. I haven't been following him. We he used to he used to live stream, okay. And okay, hold on. Message held for review. What is this? Oh, okay, we can let that come through. No, never Trump. Um. And uh, I started following him when he first started live streaming, like nine years ago. And uh, he. Uh, Um, I would tell him things and he's like, he wasn't quite sure if I was legit. And then I, I told him more stuff. And then I sent him photos of places I've been. And he's like, oh, okay. <laughs> and I told him some more things privately on the side. And he's like, okay. <laughs> so we got to be good friends. Well, never Trump. He's a criminal. He's a bum. He's a bigot. He's, and he's the biggest grifter of all time. 
Somebody's beeping the horn. Euclid. Hmm. Well, in a lot of ways, yeah. I mean, the political thing is crazy nowadays. It's not like when my father was in it. We might have frost over the weekend somewhere. <laughs> hey, I've seen snow in May. This is Cleveland. No Fredo so far. Ooh. Was I looking up here? Hate when I pick the wrong phone up and it doesn't have a SIM card in it. <laughs> it's like, uh, let's see, delete that. Where? There it is. Yeah, he was very, uh, 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 sure I drink. Rarely, but I drink. Because I can laugh, that's why. Ha 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 ha. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my. Gross. Oh, hello there, uh, Vlog Pro. Hello. Bye. Oh, hold on. Don't want to block that person. Okay, go to the waste can. See ya. Oh, my. Weird ass people, man. Oh, they might. I wore the boots today, so they might stink, you know. No big deal. Most people's feet do stink occasionally. It's nothing to be sad about. I have no idea of Log Pro. The, the amount of bizarre stuff that comes up on here. Because you don't see the stuff that they're posting that I see. So I block them. Actually, you can't block them on YouTube. All you can do is hide them. It would be better if you could block them, but that'll never happen here. If I block someone, I'm a liberal. <laughs> No, I block assholes. People who say rude, vile, vulgar, disgusting things. People who say hateful things. Uh, definitely, Dorothy. Oh, let's have some snacks. Ooh, look at that. Oh, a double M&M. &M. Oh, it's a double M&M. &M. <laughs> well, you have to have 50 subscribers, Gavin. You got to work on it.
<laughs> See it. <laughs> oh, that's too much information. Oh. Their upbringing, well, there's a lot. I mean, you know, I mean, nowadays there's just access to so much uh, foolishness. So people can learn foolishness anywhere. Well, you got to work at it, Gavin. Takes time. Don't give up. Well, here you don't know if people are just being jerks or if they're truly hateful, you know. <laughs> Thank you, say it. <laughs> hmm, I don't know. Should I say that? All these people come in here and say these things, so I usually don't. <laughs> Thank you, Sayed. I, I, I come on at all kinds of times of the day, so it can be day, daytime, nighttime, morning, you never know. Oh, my, my, my. Bill Jones. Not the guy who's Bob Jones. I think I told you that already. <laughs> oh. I'm going to sneeze. I'm going to sneeze. Ah! Hold your ears. <laughs> oh, my. I felt that one coming all the way from New Jersey. <laughs> Dinner was okay. Well, hate is uh, Gesundheit, yes. Hate is learned. Hate is not natural. It's learned. William. Uh-oh. It's going to be chilly over the weekend, but it'll be dry. Uh, yeah, I wasn't, was not close with my parents, really, especially my father. We didn't know each other at all. <clears throat> oh, you're in Vegas? I've got a lot of followers from Vegas. One of my... One, one of my moderators is there. Got a lot of good friends from, from here that live there now, too. Oh, yeah. Of course, Donald. 
I got friends in Bay Village suburb over here. This is 20 years ago. And for giggles, the one put her house on the market to see what it would bring. So they had to put a lockbox on the house. They couldn't find a key for the house because they never locked it. <laughs> That's how long it had been since they had a key. They had to go buy new locks. <laughs> you know, uh, yeah. Now you've got young kids doing way more fool foolishness than back in my day, you know. Message hell for review. Where where did that go? Where Dorothy no. Showed me his pee pee. <laughs> It's the it's the city of dreams, right? <laughs> and a lot of these comments are why you never give your children your phone ever. I would never give my kid my phone to do anything if I had kids. Never. They're not messing with my world. <laughs> uh, Monday, 60. Tuesday, rain, 68. Wednesday, 50, rain. Thursday, rain, 52. Friday, 65. Ooh, next weekend? Oh, next weekend is a big weekend in, t in the area. Let me look at the calendar. Where is the calendar? There it is. Is that the right weekend? Go back. So, yeah, next weekend is Jaga Maple Festival. The first really big festival of the year. And it's going to be amazing weather. Awesome. We'll be going. Well, it's just not, it's just scam ads. It's it's stupid stuff that they shouldn't, they don't need to see. Well, yeah, Gavin, you should not be here, in my opinion. You know, whether you have a computer or a phone, you know, you shouldn't be on YouTube. I think it's too young for a 10-year-old. I mean, that's a failure of the parents paying attention to what's going on. Yep, Chardon Maple Festival next weekend. Ed. Um, it's an awesome event if you could ever get there. Parade every day, carnival rides, beard shaving with an axe, maple syrup, pancake breakfasts, all the good stuff. No. Yeah, we don't do that either, so don't ask. Uh... No, you just ruined it. your position here by live to be a I wouldn't mind living a lot longer. You know, who knows how far I'll get. Yeah, hello. Uh... 
Oh, the original sewing and quilt expo. Should we go shopping, quilts, demos? <laughs> yes, Rami, I've been on YouTube for a long time. Yes. I hope so, Vlog Pro. I need to start taking a little better care of myself, but yeah. <clears throat> Quilts can be very cool. I mean, I, I'm not into the cheesy ones. I'm into the artsy ones. We have had a couple of really big quilt shows at some of the museums around here. Look, I didn't get there, but I saw some of them on the internet. Internet. Oh, the Indians played ball today? Here? I guess they did. Maybe? Maybe not. Yeah, I guess they did play here today. What was that nonsense? This is so stupid what this news channel is doing. They're trying to... Sh the Guardians won. Nice. Nice. My great Graham said they should cap it at 90. <laughs> I don't have any dad jokes, sorry, Christine. I don't remember jokes, so I, I'm, I'm useless at that. They go, they go in this here and they come right out. There's no stopper in there. I'm not your daddy. <sighs> I didn't realize the Cavs. Can Bandit? Come here, Bandit. What are you doing, buddy? Bam, bam. Come here, bam, bam. Bandit. Come here. Say hello. Bandit, come here. What are you doing over there? What are you doing over there? Hold on, the supervisor's here. Hold on, I'm going to bring the supervisor over. Hello there. All right, this is just getting ridiculous. I have to say goodbye to that person. Goodbye. <sighs> it is offensive. <laughs> yeah, YouTube blocked that one, so I'm going to leave it blocked. <laughs> I don't have any jokes, so don't ask. I don't remember them. Come here, you. Come here, you. What are you doing? Come here, you. Come here, you. What are you doing? Come and say hello. Come and say hello. Here's my supervisor. Here's my supervisor. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Say hello. It's Bandit. What are you doing, Bandit? You good boy? He just had a nap. Hello. You want to go outside again, probably, huh? What do you want to do? He wants to go outside. I don't know, six or so. I have no idea. He's a rescue. All right, let me go let him out. You want to go out?
your cats oh that's so sorry I'm sorry blog for yeah it gets to be sometimes yeah you reach a point where you just can't have it anymore you can't take that anymore he looks like a bandit that's why I that's why I named him that what do I got to drink here Power aid. <clears throat> a weasel. Oh, wait. So, Thursday, Friday, Saturday will be pretty decent weather, at least. They'll have good weather to set the, uh, set the festival up. Oh, there's a car driving on a flat tire. All right, I think I'm gonna cheek him. We had relatives in Gary, Indiana. I don't even know if they're still alive. No clue. Relatives on my father's side. Exactly, Dorothy. Yep. All right, folks. I'm going to veg out here, watch some TV. Thanks for showing up, folks. Thanks for the support. Remember to like, subscribe, and hit that bell. Ding. All right, and check your smoke alarms.